Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. And nobody in this atmosphere can hide from the truth about how much this game matters. The scene overflows with colour and passion. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Portugal. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We would like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. Tries to cross. Bruno Fernand. Oh, here's a chance! Straight at the keeper. Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. Forwards and with intent. And he's forced to go back. Vitinha. No goals as yet. Hops for safety. Carlson. And they've switched it over to the other side. Looking for options for movement. Will play through for the wide man. He's shifting through the gears here. Comes under pressure and it's come loose. Looking to break out here. Sweden must have been told to look for ways to try and construct some space down, down the middle here. And what is it, Jim, that they're actually achieving? Well, it opens up the pitch, stretches the opposition and it activates more running room. Jao Cancelo plays it short. Very nicely done. Look at this. And the shot! They've played it short, showing good feet, and now a sudden chance to counter. Now looking to orchestrate a counter. Shot a goal! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult. And the half-time whistle goes. Well, there it is, half-time, not a bad watch by any means. And the efforts of both sides have been good, but neither have been able to penetrate. And so we reach the break, and the game remains goalless. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. And we are already promptly back on the way. Portugal can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Now it's Diogo Jota. Starfelt. Svantberg. Still waiting for the game to take off here. Nil-nil. Augustinsson. Swung over. 
It's gone out for a throw-in. Bruno Fernandes. No breakthrough and well into the second period. It is still anyone's game. And it's Bernardo Silva. Here's Diogo Jota. Out to the right. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Well, the crowd aren't happy. They wanted a shot and it didn't arrive. Isak. He's got away. Isak plays it in. Ruben Neves. Isak. Chance to break. Isak! Keeper pulls up a fine save. Isak really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Ruben Neves. Jao Cancelo. Well played, that has snuffed out the danger. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. And that will be the final act.